Attention Buckethead fans, here's something fun and something cool. Go check out Appetite for Distortions podcast where there are many parallels drawn between Guns and Roses and Buckethead. It's like the Six Degrees of Buckethead podcast and you can always find a cool little gem. They have interviewed Azam Ali. They have interviewed Brain and now this cool interview with John Five where guess who comes up? That's right, our favorite, Buckethead. So here's a cool little scavenger hunt to go on. Were you at the show that John Five was at, Anaheim House of Blues? Were we all there together? How fun would that be? I have inserted a list of some of the Anaheim House of Blues shows that could possibly be the one he's referring to. So pause it and take a look and make sure you comment and we'll find out if we were there together. Enjoy this short little excerpt, but do make sure to go give some love to the Appetite for Distortion channel, to their videos. Give a like, a subscribe, a comment, and follow them for more. They're always bringing us some more Buckethead trivia, and they're always showing Buckethead so much love. I think that's what music's about. It's not supposed to be like, hmm, you know, I think music is supposed to be enjoyed, and it's a lot of fun, and that's how I look at it. And uh, and let me ask quickly, have you ever, because he's a similar artist as far as being instrumental and uh and forgive my lack of terminology because i'm not a musician but noodling and you know i think he's maybe a fan and that's you know it opened my eyes to instrumental artists like like you have you ever met buckethead because both of you would oh be. yeah what's he like in person have you have you seen him without oh. the bucket <laughs> <laughs> actually so i know buckethead and i've um all that stuff and we you know of course i love bucket and he knows all of my records and things like that so i would go to his shows and he comes to mine and i was like where was i, I was in anaheim and you know because he loves disneyland and i he played at the house of blues in anaheim and somebody came out and he said, oh, Bucket wants to like say hi and things like that. So I was waiting there and he comes down and he's got the Michael Myers mask on. And, um, and, he, was, and he talked really, really soft. And he said, uh, hey, John, I, I love your playing. You do that country thing so well. And I was like, oh, wow, that's cool. He said, you do that country thing so well. And so, you know, I've not seen him without the bucket or the mask, but I don't want to because mm -hmm. that's what's so cool about it. It's like seeing, you know, like Superman come down, you know, without the cape and all that stuff. So, yeah, I, I but a lot of people were like, oh, Buckethead was at your show. And. But I wouldn't recognize him. <laughs> I love that. I really I love, love that. that too. I uh, love it too. Yeah. Oh, uh, very, very cool. Isn't that just wonderful? So make sure you let us know. Were you there? Do you know which one it was? Did you get to meet John 5 too? Make sure you share your comments. We want to hear these amazing stories. Everybody out there in Buckethead land. And again, check out the Azam Ali and Brain and other interviews with Appetite for Distortion. And you will not be disappointed. It is a great podcast and so much fun playing around with six degrees of Buckethead land.